let's try to solve this next problem on lambert beer's law we have already come so far in solving the numerical problems related to lambert beer's law let's have another one second problem with respect to the last video says that the percentage transmittance of an aqueous solution of an unknown compound is 20 percent okay so the transmittance is given to us as 20 percent at 25 degrees centigrade and 300 nanometer which is the wavelength for of 2 into 10 raised to power 5 molar solution in a 4 centimeter cell calculate the absorbance and molar extinction coefficient okay so we uh, need to calculate the absorbance and the molar extinction coefficient let's proceed with it so first we are going to write down what are the given parameters in the numerical which is actually concentration which is the value of c given to us the path length is given to us which is 4 centimeter and transmittance is given to us as 20 percent okay what do we need to calculate let me write that also over here and it is actually absorbance that the question requires to be calculated and the molar extinction coefficient which the which is the need for the question so let's proceed further we know that absorbance is required so i can calculate the absorbance if i refer to the last problem that we had solved in the previous video i can refer to it from that that absorbance is somewhere related to the transmittance it is having the expression of log of 1 over t right so that means it is equal to log of 100 over 20 and from this expression i can say that the value of absorbance actually comes out to be 2 minus 1 1.3010 1.3010 okay so it is 0 0.699 this is the absorbance of the radiation okay so one half of the question is done now the second requirement is a molar extinction coefficient okay i know that the absorbance is equal to molar extinction coefficient into concentration now this concentration should be in terms of moles per liter why because molar extinction coefficient is used over here so the concentration we need to take care of it it should be in moles per liter or molarity okay absorbance that i had just calculated is 0 0.699 epsilon i need to calculate concentration is given to me and yes of course it is given to me in molar so 2 into 10 raised to power minus 5 directly i put it over here i do not need to do any conversion because it is already in terms of molarity and path length is given to us as 4 so when i substitute these values what do i get i simply get 0 0.0873 into 10 raised to the power 5 which is the value of molar extinction coefficient or i can also write it if i also uh, further want to just simplify it 8.73 into 10 raised to the power 3 which is the value of molar extinction coefficient and what should be the unit of it this is the most important part 8.73 into 10 is part 3 now since the concentration was in terms of molarity so how do i write i write it as liter per moles per centimeter this should be the unit of this coefficient extinction coefficient so this is how we solve such problems related to Lambert-Weir's law.